And in November, Angelinos will be asked to choose who they want to lead uh, the LA County District Attorney's Office. And I hope their answer will be uh, Jack DeLacy. Uh, their choice will become the chief executive of nearly a thousand attorneys, some 300 peace officers, and more than 800 support uh, staff members. Uh, their decision will impact the prosecution of some 60,000 felonies and 200,000 misdemeanors a year. So let's make sure that the voters' verdict is Chief Deputy District Attorney Jackie Lacey. Jackie is a very strong candidate with deep roots in community, deep roots in public service, and a demonstrated track record for fighting on behalf of others, particularly people who have no voice. Her strong record, her experience, her commitment is what draws me to her. This is a really simple and easy and clear choice. And she decided to go to work for the district attorney's office. You all remember James Brown, the great singer, made a hundred records and only used like 23 words, <laughs> except for one record when he said, this is a man's world. She went to work for the district attorney's office when it was a man's world. There's a great close relationship between the police department and the prosecutors. And the prosecutor for the county of Los Angeles, the city of Los Angeles, when it comes to felonies, is the district attorney's office. And Jackie has spent over 26 years in that capacity as an assistant deputy district attorney. She's done cases, she's in management, she knows how to run the office, she knows how to run the operations. Please help me in welcoming uh, the next uh, district attorney of the County of Los Angeles, Jack Lacey. The leaders of the largest city in the county understand the importance of proven and experienced leadership. I am so proud to accept the endorsement of Mayor Antonio Villaraigosa Jan Perry, Paul Koretz, my friend Dennis Zine, and uh, I am once again very honored to have the endorsement of uh, Steve Cooley and of course Councilman President Herb Weston.